Yo, what's up guys here, GTA Puffs here, and welcome back to another brand new GTA 5 video. In today's video, we're actually going to be diving into one of the elements, part of the contract DLC, that is actually going to be coming this week, and that is the agency part, the new, you know, building or business that we're going to be getting. And we're going to be diving into, you know, what we have seen from the screenshots from this agency and the armory and possibly even two locations that we might have to own prior for this uh, DLC update. So again, guys, if you are ready for this update and ready for another two videos on my channel uh, early today and into this afternoon, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the GTA Pupser channel so you are ready for when I post new content about this update and more. So let's get right into today's video. So these guys on their newswire when racks are actually, you know, uploaded that we're actually going to be getting this update and basically what they did say about this new business quote unquote they said this welcome to f clinton and partner a new celebrity solutions agency catering to the vinewood elite in need of solutions to high society problems franklin needs two things reliable partner and a big ticket high profile client with your longtime ls contract a newly aspiring cannabis entrepreneur lamar davis making the connection you can be the partner that helps Franklin take the business to the next level. So, okay, that's basically what we're going with here. Again, that basically just confirms that this whole thing is going to be a new business. And I'm pretty excited to have another way of making money in, you know, Grand Theft Auto Online. And let's actually take a look at the first screenshot that we got with Lamar Franklin and our newest character, uh, Amani is going to be looks like to be our hacker as they stated in the newswire and of course cute little chop so as you can see this looks like to be one of the floors of the armory and it looks like where Amani is going to be sitting most of the time on her screens pretty much doing the hacking probably even talking to us when we're you know participating in the missions which is also cool as well you can also see behind lamar you can see like a toolbox area it basically gives me that bunker feel now is this going to be you know look like a bunker in many ways like the interior i don't know usually rockstar uses the same type of you know interior type of looks which kind of makes it a little boring again you would like to you know change up the location and stuff like that but again we will see what rockstar has up their sleeve for this update again i'm pretty excited to see what rockstar has in store Again, this pretty much looks to be maybe the best update yet we get into grand thought grand theft auto online so we will have to see what rockstar has in stick but again that is pretty much what we have of that first screenshot now let's go over the screenshot that they have of us looking at this agency here and again, we can see a lot of things happening. Now, we're going to look at the screenshots here, and then we're going to work our way over to the trailer as well. Because again, they show us two different locations of this agency. And that makes us believe that there's not going to be one agency location that we can own in GTA 5 Online. With most businesses and buildings, Rockstar has several locations, usually in an update, probably because so no one's, you know, spawning on each other when, you know, you're coming out of the building. I just, you no, know, like, blowing up and stuff like that. But again, it looks like this is probably going to be the first floor. Again, we see that when you come down the stairs, probably you would enter coming down the stairs, you will have two assistants a guy and a female now you maybe can you know select whether you want two guys or two females again i'm not sure but again there's probably going to be some customization features again we can see that where that money poster is in this screenshot again you probably can change that wallpaper and you know stuff like that and you can see our cheats online character as well now as you look over in the sky limits there again this looks like to be pretty much in downtown Los Santos somewhere. So, again, 
that is cool that we know that as well. Now looking at the armory, this looks to be downstairs in the armory. Again, you can see the person with that pink leggings, that is Amani, again, working on her hacking techniques in the Jeet Online armory. Again, we have supposedly being either Franklin here or our Jeet Online character. Again, I cannot figure out which is which. But again, he is looking to rocking some new clothing. Those boots are probably new. Again, the clothing looks pretty new. And as you can see, it looks like he has Warstock Cash and Carry on his computer actually locked up. So again, I think that is cool as well. So again, that is pretty much all we got from the screenshots here. Now, let's move on to the trailer. And this is what the thing that I want to pay most attention to is this is another location in the trailer. As you can see, it's dark in the background. This looks to be pretty much probably uh, close to like the, the Diamond Casino. I think the community has found out where this location is. You can see the backgrounds are different in the walling. It's like gold. The yeah, wallpaper is totally different. Again, this is just a new look of what we're going to taste. So again, not a lot to dive into. It's just that the screenshot we got and the trailer uh, video is totally different than what we see. So that I want to comparison. And as we see, we get another look of what Franklin's office is going to be. Now, we're probably not going to be in his office a lot because this is probably going to be of one of the cutscenes in the game so that's what we're probably going to experience and probably when we start this you know update out and then we get another look of Amani on his computers again when I said in a previous video you cannot really take a glimpse of what she's looking at on the computers they're basically just uh, files and got a map of Los Santos so she's basically doing her work cut out for our G2 Online character on getting her ready so again that is pretty cool as well now you're probably wondering where is this location in game that we're going to be able to have this agency and armory and the GTA community actually found out where this is going to be and is down in Little Soul Park or Probably that's where it's at, right next to the skate park. Again, here's an image on your screen right now of what that actually looks like. Again, it looks like it's a tall, towery building. Again, it's probably going to have a spot where we can pull out the garage. Again, it looks like we're going to have some you know, garage spaces as well in this armory and agency. So again, that is pretty cool. So again, this is our location we're going to be getting at here. And guys, it looks like the community thinks we're going to have to own two locations. Remember, we have the Dr. Dre part of this, and that is when they showed in the trailer that we're going to be having, you know, making music, having all those mixers and stuff like that. Could we actually have to own Capitol Records building in real life that is in Los Santos? Again, that's the recording company building. Again, I will show you a picture on screen right now what that looks like. We might have to own that to help Dr. Dre, you know, find his music and stuff like that. So again, there's a lot of elements we're still not sure of that we're going to be getting in this update that we'll just have to wait till next week or more information from Rockstar. So in the comment section down below, guys, I would like to uh, hear from you what you guys are ready for this update. What do you like about the armory and agency? And do you think we're going to have to own two locations to participate in different stuff? Get out from you guys in those comment section down below. So again, guys, if I did say in the beginning of this video, I'm going to be planning on uploading two more videos to the channel. So make sure you are subscribed and hit that like button if you did enjoy today's video. Again, my name is GTA Pups, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.